All right, and we're back. Uh, yeah, so we're off to do something, right? So that's that. Silene's there. Who's this person? You're part of the survey call now, right? You should craft your own potions. Yeah, we'll get on that. Hey, is that Nurse Joy's ancestor? If you you've been to an ends, if you've been attacked by a Pokemon, you can always go to a base camp to rest. Okay. Um. Right, weren't there like requests or something? Yeah, there were. Ooh, is that a Oshawott? And is there a Rowlet? Yes, but there's no Cyndaquil. You'd probably be have been over there or something. Okay. Oshawott is just an attack. <laughs> Must feel like a prisoner. What? Finding yourself unable to pick up the items you come across? Satchel always seeming full? That sounds like you. Be wise and lend me your ear a moment and hear what I have to say. Who wouldn't want more space in a satchel? You can carry around even more than a satchel of yours if you learn the trick to packing things in. I can teach you if you like. What do you say? Teach me. Like your initiative. My teaching fee is a neat 100 polka dollars, alright? Worth it. Perfect. Then lend me your ear a moment. Oh yeah, we got an extra space slot. That's all there is to it. You see how much more you can fit in by packing things tight, rightly? If you want to be able to carry even more things, there's more I can teach you. What do you say? Teach me. Like your initiative. My teaching fee is a neat 200 poke dollars. Oh my gosh. Yes, teach me more, Sensei. Teach me all the things. Yeah, 400 Poké Dollars, no problem. Yeah, Baggin. Oh, I guess I, guess I understand why his name's Baggin. Give me more. Space is very valuable in games. Oh, 1,000 Poké Dollars. It rose. Quite a bit. Fifteen hundred polka dollars, sure. How much? Oh, two thousand polka dollars. How much technique is there to putting things tightly in my satchel? Twenty five hundred polka dollars, huh? Is all our money gonna go into making a <laughs> super efficient satchel? 3,000 polka dollars. Ah, Zounds. Well, that I could teach you, but you've got to pay my fee first. Come back when you can. Rip. I ran out of money. I'm poor. What's up with you, duck? What's up, duck? You there. You seem like uh, someone who enjoys a bit of crafting. Do you think you could help me out with something? I'd be very, very grateful if you try to craft something useful <laughs> using a special recipe I came up with. He looks angry. So without further ado, here's the recipe. Pokeshi dolls? Oh, it takes some wood. Alright, I'll make you a Pokeshi doll. Sheesh. Except I only have two wood. Rip. Hey, how's it going? You, uh, you get Legends Arceus? 
It's a pretty sweet game, if I do say myself. The game's finally caught up with what the show would feel like if it, if the show would be a game. Yeah, it's real fun. Decided to uh, not wear the ball guy head because I wanted to fully enjoy playing this game and not be uncomfortable. Yeah, yo, what's up, Walker? Okay, so, uh, wait a minute. What? Thought I did. Haven't been online much, but it's been fun. Yep, yep, yep. How are things, my good friend? Oh, it's Volo. Uh, who I suspect to be Cynthia's uh, ancestor. Oh, I certainly hope you're putting that secret back strike technique I taught you to good use. Either way, I have some super potions here just for you. Oh, think nothing of it. Having the survey core out and about studying Pokemon is great for business, you know. Supporting you now is actually an investment in my own fortunes. Oh, three super potions. Awesome. Now I must depart. There are ruins that are just calling to me. Okay. And now I got to talk to this guy. Right, a Pokemon starts eyeing me off playing an Orenberry. Then run while it's distracted. Not bad, work's been crazy right now, but otherwise can't complain. And going to be moving to Denver in June, hopefully. Hey, there you go. Nice. Then run while it's distracted. If I just stick to the plan, I'll be fine. Oh, Survey Corps boy. I was just headed out to the field lands to go gather tumble stones, but I haven't got as many Orenberries as I like. Are you familiar with Orenberries? They restore HP to Pokemon that eat them, and so as you imagine, Pokemon teams be very interested in them. You see where I'm going with this? Throwing Orenberries is a great way to distract and avoid wild Pokemon. They're indispensable. With that in mind, could I trouble you to gather five Orenberries for me? Yes, yes. Yeah, take these five warm berries. I gratefully accept. Gosh, I can't believe you went to the trouble of finding these just for me. No, I just had them laying around. Happy to help. Thank you. Oh gosh, you're nice for someone who fell out of the sky. Let's just tuck away in my satchel. I won't let you go to waste. Hey, let's go to waste. Wish me luck with those uh, tumble stones. Yay! Revives. Hey, there you go. What up? Do you have some Pokemon you'd like to leave them with me? No, not really. None of my mons are ready to evolve yet. Um. Yeah. Pretty basic mons. I know I missed a Pichu and an Eevee. Oh, hey, look, there are all my Pokemon. I wonder if I could... I wish I could hop the fence. I wonder if I can. Maybe, maybe not. I would love to play with all these mons. Anyways. Um... Yeah. I heard... That the, I don't know if you would know about the Drift Loon, but there's a uh, rumor that the Drift Loon are snatching people up or something. Yep, blah 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 blah. Yep, it's a whole Pokedex entry with uh, snatching kids up to go to the afterlife. Is that them right there? You not heard of that rumor? Listen to Eric, survey core kid, I saw the darndest thing. I was scouring the heartwood for crops we could grow in air in the field when I saw it. This Pokemon named Cherim changed its appearance before my very eyes. It was in the evening. Light was getting dim. All of a sudden, Cherim's petals closed right up so it looked like nothing but a little but flower bud. Wow, I thought. I just witnessed a miracle of evolution. Next morning, when I went to check in on a tarum, it was right back to full bloom. Hey, for it, how's it going? Why would it bloom just to close back up? Is that how evolution works? Or is the change I saw something different? Taco Bell ad, yes. When you finish Cherim's Pokedex entry, let me have a look, would you? Did 
to bloom or not to bloom? Yo. Yep, these farmers are here. You gotta expand these here fields to help feed all the new folk. Stuff picking berries out in the wild, so I'm hoping we can grow here instead. Here in the village fields, you can have crops grown for you. Yo, what's up for how to grow some crops? Here to grow some crops, are you? No way to tell how the yield will be. Well, we'll give it our all. What kind of harvest are you interested in? I want some apricorns. Oh my gosh, it costs 500 for apricorns? Nah, I'll save my money. Medicinal harvest. No. You know what? No. You want a genuine reaction. You're keeping... Wait, what? Oh, shiny cleaver a secret? Like, you're, are you not spoiling shiny cleaver for you? Yeah. I kind of had Hisulian uh, Typhlosion spoiled for me, so... RIP. Well, I actually... Yeah, it sucks, it sucks. But yeah, I'm really glad what they did with this game. It feels... I saw the shinies I wanted to see. Gotcha. Those darn Badoof. I hear you caught three different species. I have a job that's perfect for a high achiever like you. See, I need to help research it. Arg, it's those pesky Badoof again. Oh no, Badoof! You might get Arceus tomorrow? I hope so, For You're missing out here. I look away for one second and the little scoundrels waltz right into the village. Oh, this is awful. I'm a complete failure as a member of the security corps. How can I face Captain Zizuas like this? No, get a hold of yourself, Tsumugi. Just catch the Bidoof and everything will be fine. Still, three Bidoof is a lot. Two more than I could think I could handle on my own, in fact. Well, I have an idea. I heard that these particular pests get easily distracted if other Bidoof are nearby and end up letting the guard down around humans. So if you bring a Bidoof to draw their attention, I can seize that chance to catch their little troublemakers. Voila, we'll the perfect plan. If we combine forces, we'll get all three caught in no time at all. Okay, so I have a uh, Bidoof in my party. So I guess I'm gonna go look for Bidoof. Yeah, for it, this game is uh, what the, um, it feels like the anime or manga, Pokemon manga. You actually can stalk the Pokemon and catch them. Instead of just running into them and just sending out your mon and then trying to check the ball at it. All right, keep an eye out for some uh, Badoo. Chomp, chomp. Oh yeah, thanks. I'm gonna go to sleep. All right, good night. Got it. Great going, team. See ya for it. Um. Yeah, we're good at dodging, I guess. Whoa. Hi, Clarissa of the Security Corps. That's me. Thank you so much for taking on my request. I need you to catch a Zubat and show it to me so I can take a good look at its eyes. I'll request, I know, but I have a good reason for it. Zubat never seem to have trouble flying, flying around in pitch darkness. That means their night vision must be top notch. If I could learn how to see in the dark like them, night shifts on guard duty would be a breeze. I'm counting on your help. Catch a Zubat and come show it to me, would you? Yep, here you go. Uh, in this box. I'll take a look at those peepers if you please, Zubat. Don't think it has any eyes. But they wouldn't know that because they don't like hanging out with Pokemon. Huh? Where are the eyes on this little guy? Don't tell me, it doesn't have any eyes? But what that means, Zubat flies around while being completely blind. Hmm, Zubat must have some other kind of secret sense that if it doesn't need the eyes. Yeah, that's amazing and all, but it hardly helps me. What am I going to do when, if, about my nighttime shifts on guard duty? Get a partner Zubat? Oh, look at her face. Well, that's a good idea. No need for me to go it alone, after all. A little help would be nice. 
That's that then. I'll go out there and find a Zubat that can help me as my partner. Thanks for the great advice. Ooh, Locks Power. Um. Okay, so we found two Bidoof, I think. I think that means we gotta find one more. Ooh. So, gotta keep an eye out for Bidoof's Shrine Guardian watching over us. The seal sells for various protective charms that come in handy when you're out exploring the wilds. I'm here to give thanks for the guardian of this shrine. Who watches over all in Jubilee Village? And you, child, if you're here with a prayer for the shrine, perhaps my charms can help. Tell me, what is your wish? Um. Stay in good health. Sure, I'll take it for 500. Oh no, I don't have any money. I spent it all uh, mastering the technique of packing stuff into my satchel. Ah. <laughs> uh. And there's the worm pool. Alright. Um Yo, where's the Badoof? There's there should be like one more. Listen carefully now. Do do So, oh hey, there it is. Chomp chomp, oh man. Was it? <laughs> Too bad it wasn't an alpha Bidoof. Caught it, great going team. Okay, actually we need to find one more Bidoof. Um... Hmm. What? Can Pokemon of the same species really come in different sizes? I know the professor said they do, but I'll have a hard time believing it. Plus, I see different sized ones lined up side by side. If they really are Buizel bigger than mine, I'd love to see them alongside the one I have. Comparison, say. And you're a natural when it comes to catching Pokemon, right? I bet you see where I'm going with this. If you catch Weasel bigger than mine, would you let me have it? I'll make it worth your while? What? Okay. Have you brought me a bigger Weasel? Um... I can't tell. Is this bigger? Good gravy, I never expected you to bring one so quickly. I'm afraid I'm looking for a bigger one, though. One that's at least 2 8. Okay. Guess size matters for this. Check the summary. Alright, fine. Looks like we gotta go find a weasel. Everybody on my friends list is playing Pokemon Legends Arceus. No, check the summary of the Buizels. You hear something? That you have. Boo 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 boo. I swear I heard a chimchar or something. Anyways, keep an eye out for a Badoof, will ya? There should be one somewhere. But where? 
Where, oh where, can I find a Badoo? Hmm. Behind the building, perhaps. Nope. Also should look at uh, how to find quests. I'm in between buildings. Doesn't really appear to be a Bidoof here though, so. Hmm. I think I've been everywhere, but I can't, I still can't find a Bidoof. Badoof are not here. Yeah, no Badoof here. No Badoof here. There's just no Badoof. Or maybe it was just two Badoof I needed. Um, it seemed like they were two earlier. In that one scene. I'll talk to the person. <sighs> I think the quest person said there were two. No, there's definitely three, because we just talked to the quest person. Oof. Yes, or more specifically, Bidoof. Bidoof. Where are you at? Bidoof. Yeah, the Badoof is definitely somewhere, I just don't know where that somewhere is. Oh, almighty Arceus, please help me out on the quest to find the Badoof. I don't know if it'd be out here on the farm. I'm thinking it's in the village somewhere. I think we looked at all the places it could be. I think it'd be inside. Go back. What do you mean go back? Do you see it? An investigation prompt. Oh no, that's just a bridge.
Yep, yeah, it's just Canela Bridge. Take a signpost. Keeping an eye out for the Badoo. Okay, uh, maybe I'll check this area. Uh, it's an area I haven't really been. There's no wild Pokemon around here. Of course there isn't. But there could be a Badoo somewhere. It's Prelude Beach, but uh, yeah, no sign of a doof here. you get the first Badoof uh, back near like over here I guess see and I got the second one somewhere I forget where exactly y'all at, doof? Uh, apparently not behind these buildings. Try checking by the Galaxy Hall. Well, I did, I think. Dude. trade for Pokemon. I want to get items. Uh, ten of these, huh? Oh, look at these. I bet you we need them to evolve some mons. Uh, Linking Core. Alright. What do you think about a Bidoof being around here? I think I heard a Bidoof. I can't be sure yet. I hear something. You hear that? Wasn't that the Bidoof? Badoof was around this far. Like, okay. 
probably probably closer to the hay area we'll see I, I don't think so oh no I don't know. The last Bidoof does not appear to be around here. Hey, it's Joy. I don't have the funds, I'm a poor person. Hmm. Did you check the one by the Galaxy Hall, by your house? Do you even know where my house is? This is a photography place. I think this is my house. One of these is my house. The back side. Whoa, dude, really? No way. Chomp, chomp. It blended in with the wood. Got it. Great going, team. Yo, here's the doof. That puts all the little troublemakers safely in our custody. Now to give them the old hero. Hold on. It'd be a shame to send those doof back into the wild now. My construction corps could find a use for them. Oh, you want to keep them? These naughty nibblers have caused so much trouble for the construction corps. They're just Pokemon being Pokemon. How are they supposed to know our village is a strict no chewing zone? She has good taste on their part to come all the way here to Nawn or Woodwork too. If they're gonna stay here, they'll have to help with their work. They've got the guts to keep trying to get into the village, plus the teeth to gnash through trees and rocks. Just what a cord needs. How about it, little ones? Meals taste better after a day's work, you know. Oh, the Badoofs. This is what I wanted to hear. Hmm, I'm not convinced I have it in them to do an honest day's work. What Sanquia's watching them? I'm sure it'll be work out all right. I guess that's settled then. Thank you again for your Barbas and Badoof. Hey, we got a rare candy. Awesome. So we took care of the Badoofs. Now I want to go look at the. Uh, What's this loss and found? If you black out in the field, you may lose any items. However, players from all over the world can help you find your lost items and send them to you via the internet. This system is called Lost and Found. Ooh. We can get MP by returning them. Okay, so. Awesome. We can just. Go find some in the obsidian field lands. Yeah, I'll go look in the field land heights for now. I will start from the beginning to look for those, and I don't know. I heard tell that, uh, Wait a minute. Um, okay. Frenzy. Take a rest and do some camping. 
We got a couple things here. Big boozle, little boozle. We got to find a spring mushroom. There's. We got to talk to Mickey of the Security Corps for this drift loon thing. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess we got to fill out the Cricket Tots Pokedex page and show it to a. Uh, Oh, and uh, I mean, we got a couple Geo dudes too. We gotta show, yeah, we gotta catch a Cherum. And we gotta make a Pokeshi doll. No, I did not get rid of the game corner thing. I don't know, it might be down or something. Okay, so let's uh, get to it. Gotta catch all the Badoos. Oh shoot. Looks like we have a Pokemon that could evolve. Um. something show me your moves it, it's okay just confusion So there's Pichu and Eevee out there that need to be capped. Oh no. Oh shoot, that's a cricket dot. Go, kind of cricket dot. Smash it up. <laughs> oh man, it saw me. Oh no, I'm battling. Didn't really mean to do this. Oh, I ran away. Yeah. 
Yes, yes. I didn't want to battle though. I didn't want to battle. <sighs> Just want some apricots, mate. I guess I should also try to catch a weasel or something. Oh, hey, it would. Got a weasel. Question is, is it the weasel we're looking for? Uh, that's a pretty good question. Yes, yes, larger than two, eight. Just a cricket, nothing to be worried about. Oops. Gotta catch the worm pole. Gotta catch the shinx. Shinx that's chasing after me. Oh my gosh. Oh, Pikachu, the Pichu, we got the Pichu by surprise. Yes. Yo, you know we gotta get that Pichu in our party. You know we gotta do that. You know that. Okay, so uh, unfortunately, back in the pasture. But we can swap it out in the base camp. Okay, so first of all, we gotta go look for the Eevee. You said there might be an Eevee around here, right? Ow. 
Yo, not cool. It just hit me. A bug whoa, whoa, it's a beauty fly. I guess we'll have to do this this way. Let's go, Badoo. A stun spore. Badoo? Oh man. Alright, but if I believe in you, just use a bite. Aw, oh, stun spawn again. Good, good going, Badoo. Yes, Badoo. Ah, this beauty fly has nothing on us. Fight again. Don't kill it! No! It's a crit hit! Oh man, beautiful. I mean, we can find another one. But... I mean, at least, uh, you know, they seem to got levels. They got levels. Okay, so let's evolve some of these guys. Evolve. Shinx, you're now a Luxio. A fearsome Luxio. Yes, evolution seems a bit more epic and darker. Alright, Stolly, you too. I guess uh, that beautiful light gave us a bunch of experience. Yo! You wish you kept your switch. Oh hey, look, it's another Badu. I mean, a uh, beauty fly. Oh, I uh, bopped it in the head. Hey, we caught a beauty fly. No uh, battling needed. Am I right? <laughs> oh, this area seems a little dead, doesn't it? Weird. Oh no. I guess we gotta... Alright, let's go. Let's go cynically. Aw, oh, shoot. It's paralyzed. Ember. Burn, baby, burn. Ooh, you're paralyzed. Oh yeah. Um, Pokeball, go. Yo. Beautifully got. Okay, looks like Badoof and Cyndaquil can evolve now, so we're going to do that. Let's go Cyndaquil. Hey, it's a Kulava. And here's Badoof. Evolving into... Bibara. That's sweet. Looks like another beauty fly. Wait, we can do this. Alright, let's go with a flame wheel. 
Boom! Oh, beautiful. It hangs on by thread and it uses iron defense. Silver wind, huh? No, it escaped. No, I'll block you with my body. All right, I'll throw another Pokeball right. No, it escaped again. I will block it with my body. Well, I know you're not doing so hot, but here. No! This beautiful I grew enraged. Uh -oh. No, no, no. Oh no, Quilava. Well, it's up to Bibaro now. Well, I guess we should also craft some Pokeballs. We're kind of running a little low. There we go. Sweet! Is that a Dust Tox? Yeah, it is. Uh... I mean... Oh, come on. Ouch. Dust stops. I'm in no mood. Yo! We're not doing so hard. We gotta get out of here. Dust Tox comes out at night, it appears. Is that a cascoon? Oh my gosh, it's an Alpha Luxio. I mean, we could try it. But I kind of don't want to. Skedaddle. Yeah, not in our state. Equilava's down. I don't want to try it. And it's a Drifter. Oh boy. Not good, not good. Where's the camp? Uh, I have no idea. Yo, oh, you didn't see anything. Bop. Bop. And... Bop. There we go. Okay, we gotta go up and uh, heal or something. There's an Eevee around these parts, but I don't know if it only comes out during the day or what. What I do know is that I want to heal up my Kulava. 
And then I want to go up to the weird ear place. Also, I only have one star. Yes, yes, what else? Nice. We got some more money. Hmm. I guess we could uh, get the second uh Second star, if we talk to Silene. But yeah, pretty easy, pretty easy. Captain, reporting in. Our investigation for the commander will grind to a halt if you could become a decapitated recruit. I should like to avoid that outcome. I imagine you would as well, since it may mean losing the food and shelter we provide for you. If you have progress report, I will show judge its worthiness. Show me the Pokedex. Hmm, you have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. Yo! With this, you have officially attained the rank of second star in this galaxy expedition. I can use feather balls! Ooh, we need a sky tumble stone. And super potions, huh? Awesome. Ar Akari. Grand Tree Arena, huh? And I guess I can end it here for the YouTube peeps. See you guys in the next one.